Might have been made last minute, but I can promise you that with this gift, you will not last a minute. My gift is stuffed and dead inside, like how you're gonna be later tonight. I'm trying to live though. Nothing in this yeah. world could have prepared me for that. Call me Santa Claus, I have so many ho ho hoes. Oh, yep. <laughs> okay. Have you ever sucked toes before? I think ghosting's okay. You think, think ghosting's, ghosting's okay? Is okay? Um, are you in a BDSM? Oh. I don't know. Is that kind of music or? I, don't know. I just I don't like know. to be as. <laughs> right into it. So you're not into spanking? You won't spank a girl? Um, no. Wait, so you're a virgin? Okay, guys, so what is the kinkiest, naughtiest thing you've ever done? What kind of girl are you guys looking for? What kind of guys are you guys looking for today to be your Christmas date? Adventurous. Funny as frick. I need her to be bold. Like, I need her to be bold to a point where, like, a six foot four motherfucker comes up to her and she punches him in the face right there just to not talk to her. Fit, athletic, confident. I want a girl that has a big personality and someone I can share hot cocoa with. He has to be a bottom bitch. <gasps> What's a bottom bitch? Oh, someone who will do what I say. You know, he has to be a sub. Oh, <laughs> fire. He's gotta do the dishes. I want my girl to have a big, fat heart. You know, I'm the lover. I just want a girl that my family won't judge. They judge a lot Damn. of people. Hopefully they like her. I just need a girl to watch some Hallmark movies with. I love Hallmark movies around Christmas time. Ew. Oh. Damn. <laughs> She's a ew. I packed this big present for nothing. What's up, ladies? Body the elf. I love it. I love it. I'm grabbing that carrot. Do you like it? <laughs> I love it. I light up, bro. I'm pretty lit. It lights up. Oh I'm pretty God. lit. What up, YouTube? What's going on, guys? Before we start the video, make sure to like, share, and subscribe. Make sure to comment within the first thousand comments because we are picking two lucky people to win 50 buckaroonies. All right, guys, so today we're gonna be dating based off Christmas presents. So every round, they're gonna get to know each other and it's gonna be time. At the end of the round, they will discuss in front of the opposite group who they're keeping and who they're eliminating. It's gonna get spicy. Ugh. Feelings are gonna get hurt. Yeah, I, I'm not ready for no, that You're one. good, you're tall. Okay, thank um, you. <laughs> and um, before we start the round, you all brought Christmas presents. We can't, you know, reveal what you guys brought, but we're gonna go down the line and reveal to the other team what you brought but without telling us what you brought. Hopefully it's funny and funny. Hi ladies, my name is Caleb, and my gift is based on one of my favorite quotes. If it ain't on the wood, it ain't no good. What kind of wood are we talking? Mm -hmm. Hard. Nice and woody. Hi boys, my name is Lucy. Um, my gift is something you can wear to film cinematic back shots of us. Like, like when you pose up in front of the camera and it's a back shot like that? Well, maybe you'll find out later. Oh, shit. Maybe I would. Hi ladies, my name is Nick. My gift simply is something we can use to have fun in the bedroom, something for defense, and honestly, something it's a multi-use tool. Pretty sure it looks like a baseball bat. You're into BDSM? <laughs> well, hi, my name is Sam. My gift is something that I think would turn up the heat between the two of us when we're together, so. I hope it's a heated right. blanket. One. My gift is very dear to my heart. It's long, hard, you can ride it all night long, and you'll never be bored of it. Ever. I'm in love. Hi, my name is Savannah, and I thought when we were done with my gift, hopefully you'll be like, that was finger looking good. Oh, I'm Kev, uh, and this gift, you, uh, it can get you places, and you know, I can get you places that I may not be able to reach, but this might get you almost there. It could be anything. <laughs> I can't tell what it is, so. No, I can't. Yeah. It's hard to tell. Uh, my name is Essie. You know, my gift, it might have been made last minute, but I can promise you that with this gift, you will not last a minute, so. She's a fast rapper. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, beautiful ladies? My name is Joshua, and my gift is, it's sticky and grippy, and can be made into a thong, but with one wrong move, it's gonna have you sing a Michael Jackson song. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. Hey, you got a whole poem. Okay, Dr. Swan. <laughs> yeah, that was very good. <laughs> Hi, I'm Lydia. Um, my gift is stuffed and dead inside, like how you're gonna be later tonight. I'm trying to live, though. I'm trying oh, to be yeah, a little turkey. Like... <laughs> so, yeah, so the round starts now. Good luck. Oh, oh, hang on, guys. I need to adjust my gift. Oh, oh, oh. 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 No, that's pretty good. I like the hey, gift. Yo. Wait, 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 wait. All right, it's my OCD. Thanks, guys. Now we can get started. It's crooked again. All right, I got, I got a question. 
How many situationships y'all been in? Ooh. This year? Ooh. Zero. Zero. Okay, now honestly. Zero. <laughs> you got me, you got me. Like two. All right, all right, I got, I got a deep question. This is gonna, we're gonna be deep. Who here has an OnlyFans? You said that's a deep question? That was like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> that's deep. Like, I'm as deep as, as deep question? All right, vulnerable. I'm taking you both, yep. Oh. <laughs> Wait, what does that mean? What do you mean by that? It's a good thing, it's a good thing. You're trying to collab? I said, gentlemen, who here likes going down on a woman? King. Uh, <laughs> only one? Only one? <laughs> like, if you're saying down, like, going down and then praising the Lord, I'm down for that. But you will be on your knees. I'm, 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 I'm a lot better on my knees anyways. What is your guys' biggest red flag? Oh. Not going down on a girl. Oh. Okay. Boom. I think ghosting's okay. You think ghosting's, ghosting's okay? Ghosting is okay? I'm saying, what's your biggest red flag about yourself? No, You're that I, own. if I was to ghost, it would be okay. You're okay with oh. ghosting people, like, straight up? I think it's okay. What's like, okay, okay, but what's like the cutoff for ghosting? Like, is it after one day, or are you ghosting people after, like, we've been out five times? And, I think like, it depends just... the situation, but, like, after one day, an easy ghost is okay. But if we've been dating for a while, and you do something that I don't like, I'm gonna ghost you. Just like, no, even, like, no two years? Like, yeah, two years. What? And you just, like, you just don't show up. Me. Yeah, stop talking to you. I mean, look, she's being honest. I, mean, I, did not, I, like, I appreciate it. respect the honesty. I appreciate yeah, the yeah, honesty. Yeah, 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 That's, yeah. I mean, wow. Wow. Have you ever been ghosted? And I'm talking, like, after... Did yeah, someone cause this to you, and then you started doing it others? I think I've been ghosted once. And how did you feel? I was fine. Me when I lie. <laughs> My red flag is that I don't cook, and I don't do the dishes, so... Well, if you don't cook, there's no <laughs> dishes to do, so you're good. <laughs> I could do Hot Pockets, I could do pizza bagels. That's quick and well, easy. Well, I have this app called Uber Eats. We can yes. order every night. <laughs> What's the DoorDash bill looking like for the year? <laughs> My mom pays oh, for it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> My mom pays for it. Hmm, my red flag would probably be that I'm very independent, so. That's a red That's flag? That's a red flag. Yeah, well, sometimes guys want you to talk to them all day, every day. I don't have the time for that, unfortunately, but I give what I can. Oh, I love that. My red flag is I have a pet pig, three possums, four snakes, two frogs, three geckos, uh, a turkey. How big is your house? A cat. <laughs> what? And a dog. Did you steal those? You say you have a cat? Is that legal? It lives outside. Yeah. Oh, okay, gotcha. Oh, I also have, I also have seven hedgehogs. I've always wanted to be a farm guy. Aww. So whenever you need me to, I will take care of those and like baby them. And clean poop? Whatever you need me to, I'll get down on my knees and- You found your you son. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna pick him. That's a lot of poop. That's crazy, yeah, that's, that's kind of nuts. Um, are you in a BDSM? I don't know. Is that kind of music or? <laughs> Is that like uh, music? When you put a leather suit on and they whip you? And the mask. I'm gonna go with no on this one. <laughs> yeah, can you explain it just for like the viewing? It's like playing cops and robbers, but adult. So is it like Fifty Shades of Grey? No, Fifty Shades of Grey is very vanilla. Okay, I want to be the cop then. More like cocks and robbers. Sorry. I'm gonna go with a no on that one. I don't know if anybody heard that. No. Why not? He said I don't want to be hit again. Ah, uh, just no. So you're not into spanking? You won't spank a girl? Um, no. <laughs> what about in public? In public? In public, would you spank her? For what she do wrong? <laughs> Some girls just need a little spanking. <laughs> And guys, and guys also need spanking more than the girls. <laughs> I got a, uh, I got a question. How would you guys describe your humor? I would say offensive. I like dark humor. Say offensive. Okay. Offensive. I like that. Yeah. If you can't handle the offensive stuff. Yeah. yeah. I like dark humor too, but a lot of times when people say they have dark humor, they're just racist. Do you actually have like dark humor though? I'm. <laughs> huh. That's a pun in itself. Dark humor. <laughs> no, but like you know what I mean. Like, trying to get a little bro canceled. I swear to God, all the time I'll meet people, they say the dark humor. They're just being, and they're just being racist. racist right? you know, yeah. You know what I mean? No, I'm saying like don't be racist. No, not no, I'm not for that. I think like if you're cool and witty and you're fun, you like to banter, like that's like fun. I love that. I'm the same pitch. <laughs> What's your least favorite sex position? That's a thinker, bro. Wait, can I answer this? Yeah. The JFK is when I splatter all over her while she screams and tries to get out of the car. Okay, <laughs> that was I'm done. I'm done. I like that for sure. Nothing in this yeah. world could have prepared me for that. Dark humor. Dark yeah, humor. yeah, I like that. I mean that's historical. That's yeah. just She's smart. I would say reverse cowgirl, honestly. Good answer. I like being more like in control, you know, instead of like riding, just like going with the flow of things. Yeah, Seeing her face too, like I know like, some people are like, I don't want to see her face, we're fucking- What is she like, really uh, ugly? I'm girl. not gonna make her feel insecure. I'm just gonna be like, it's more fun. When the girl is on the bottom and I'm on the top, cause that's boring. <laughs> Woo! I, I want to try out some crazy positions, like her on the top and even some sideways actions, like some, I like that. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I'm just assuming. Yeah, just assuming. I, I'm more of just like any position, as long as like the feelings are there and there's like genuine love. I'm a lover. I'm not like a 
a fucker. Oh, you're so, <laughs> <laughs> so sweet. That's cute. Uh, this is probably going to come as a shock to some of y'all, but I actually don't know because I'm waiting till marriage. That's wow. why you don't like BDSM. That's why I'm not into BDSM, mainly because I thought it was music to this point. Wait, so you're a virgin? Yes. How old are you? 30. That's impressive, good for you. It got quiet in here real quick, guys. You want to sit No, 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 no. I didn't give a round of applause. I would have assumed that that one was the version. Oh, <laughs> oh no, I have this guy a This is slain. This guy is slain. Call me Santa Claus, I have so many ho ho hoes. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right, question. What's your guys' biggest turnoffs? Virgins. Yeah, I don't really like when a guy can't value conversation. Like, I went on a bad date, this guy, we were sitting at the bar. He chose the bar in the restaurant, and he just like watched the game the whole time. Who was playing? I'm just asking. That's not important. That's not important. That's not important. My bad, my bad. I think it was like basketball or something. Ah, yeah, yeah, my bad. Um, I would say, this is like an, an age thing, but any guy who isn't financially stable, if he's over the age of like 27. Hmm. Yeah. That's a good one. Big turn off. Yeah. Oh, you got time. Yeah, yeah you're good. three years. You got so. three years to mess around, bro. You're good, you're chilling. You're good. You're chilling. <laughs> What's financially stable? Oh, yeah, that's a great um, question. I would say financially stable would be like after you, you can like pay all your, all of your bills, live comfortably, and not stress about money. You're able to put money back into your savings, into your Roth IRA, your 401k, whatever it yes. is. Roth IRA <laughs> investments. I like, I like that. her. <laughs> Don't you have an OnlyFans? Can't you just pay for all of us? Dude, no, I'm not doing that anymore. I'm done being a sugar mama. I'm, <laughs> I'm wasted so much money on men, no more. David, I'm in love. Um, my biggest turn off is when someone has a massive penis. Fire. Oh. Well, we're all I, good. I mean, oh, fuck. No, I mean, don't gotta worry. Yeah, we're good, uh, fellas. We're good. Um, we, yeah, we're changing back shit. there. So. How would you describe massive? Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. What yeah. size? Tell me what yeah, yeah. Girth, describe anything the girth. over six inches. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Sorry. That's massive. Yeah, that's yeah, that's huge. <laughs> the big one's hurt. Yeah, that's awesome. Have you ever sucked toes before? Oh no. Yeah. Um, I mean, I'd be open to it. I'd be open to it. Like oh. yeah. when the occasion arises, just clean it off a little bit. You know. He said, I will put it in my mouth if it is a toe. <laughs> All right, so that was the end of round one. The guys will now discuss in front of the ladies who they want to keep and who they want to eliminate. All right, like, I'm gonna start with rough. liking. Okay. Love the tats. Okay. And Essie's eyes, great. Okay. I, I think we should keep her. I like the light up sweater. Love the farm animals. Love. You're into the animals? I love the animals. I mean, I love animals too, but that was a lot of animals. Dude. She has, she, she might have a farm. No, she said snakes. She might have a she, farm. No, no, she said snakes. Take care of 20 animals. She said, awesome. hey, I'm not, not, if you want to keep it cool, go ahead. But I like, love animals. But snakes. That's still, it's easy. You just keep them in little It's cage. easy. All right, whatever. It could be. Right, I'm, what you think? I, I, I feel that, I feel that she's the riskiest. Like, I feel like she would cheat on me. Like, damn. Like, I, like, no, that's the thing is they seem too good to be true. You know those types? I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not cool with the, all the animals, but if you, but if you love them, want to keep them. Oh yeah, you're a dog I, person. I don't know. I think, uh, I think it was the BDSM that scared him. <laughs> okay, okay. The, and that, and that too. <laughs> Scary. Not it. All right, guys. Oh <laughs> no! Come Ooh, on. Sorry, All he's right. making the decision. This is very diplomatic over here. All right, so who are you guys eliminating? Okay, um, Olivia. There is no. Oh, yeah, what are you doing? We're going. It's with you. The, no. the Again? The animals, the, an, the animals is just weird. Like, it's a lot. Wait, but can I pick who to eliminate before I leave? You help us pick. The virgin's gotta go. Oh. oh. Wait, hold on. Wait. <laughs> Wait. Oh. 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 <laughs> I didn't mean to insult your snakes. I'm sorry, like snakes just really freaked me out. That was my only thing. Now that the guys have eliminated, you're still involved in the elimination of a guy. Wonder who she's gonna pick. Okay, sick. Um, the virgin's gotta go. Um, <laughs> Do we all agree? Like, yeah. yeah, the virgin's gotta go. Oh. I like his height though. Is he really a virgin? His height is a little no favorable. Way. The virgin, really? Being tall is so basic. He's not a virgin, look at his face. The virginity, I don't know. A little. No, but it, it might be a good thing. It might be a green flag. I haven't met a guy that's a virgin. But you'd have so. to train him. Like his age. Oh, he yeah. said we have to train yeah, him. Yeah, but he's 30. <laughs> Does he really need training? They do need training. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> the virgin's gotta go. Are you a fast learner? <laughs> <laughs> Are you a man of the Lord? Say yes, say yes. I vote we keep Buddy the Elf for sure. Yeah, I agree. Okay, um, thank you. Oh, this guy, he's the only one who raised his hand for going down on women, so he has to that's stay. That's right, okay, that's he's gonna true. stay. He has to stay. That one accused me of cheating, but it's okay. <laughs> Tough. This is tough. Okay, you ladies have to decide. I can't. Can I decide? <laughs> hey. That guy. I'm sorry I insulted your snakes. I apologize for that. I just don't like snakes. Bye. No. Oh my god. god. This is brutal. Yeah, everyone is really nice. This is super hard. It's not that hard. The person's gotta go. <laughs>
David, I think they've come to a decision. All right, ladies, who have you guys decided to eliminate? Virgin! Oh. I appreciate, I appreciate your virgin. determination. Damn. I do. Yeah, I like it too, yeah. That's okay, Bubba. Thanks, buddy. The most action he's ever got. All right, so the guys have eliminated Lydia, and I feel like Lydia eliminated Caleb. So if the guys would have picked you, what would they have gotten? Oh, they would have gotten <laughs> one whole stuffed raccoon. Oh my God. Is that one of your pets? <laughs> yeah, he died, so I stuffed him. And y'all were second Can guessing Can I touch me. it? Yeah. Wait, what was its name? Oh my God, it's real. Is um, it real? Ralphie the raccoon. Oh my gosh, it's like looking it's, at I think me. it's real. Oh, he's so cute. I can tell by his furry's mouth. Wait, people actually that do was that? His last look. Yeah. A little terrifying, but wow. it's okay. I don't know if I should have like touched that. All right, Caleb, what would the girls have gotten if they chose you? I'm excited to see. It's just my phone. Oh. Because they don't do in-person tickets anymore, but it would have been courtside tickets to the Lakers. Oh. Boo, sports, boo. Yeah. Totally fine, totally fine. Y'all, you wanna, y'all wanna go? Okay, cool. All right, I'll find a date. Let me know. Hey, let me, me know. and you. Hey, let me know. Me and you got along. We we were coming. Very nice to meet you. Dude. You have to shake really. its hand. I, you oh, know, yeah, it, it's, it's beautiful. Shake it's beautiful. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. I ain't touching it. Bye. Good luck. Bye. 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 All right. So now we're gonna move on to the next round. You guys have eight minutes this time uh, to get to know each other, and then we're gonna do another elimination. So good luck. All right. Time starts now. If you're on a date, what's your go-to? meal like what's your favorite food to eat mm. like off the bat oysters because they're an aphrodisiac what? what's Afri Afri Af aphrodisiac what's it makes you want to climb out freaky deaky oh i've never had an oyster <laughs> ever oh i kind of want to try one out. yeah we should maybe do that <laughs> I'm down. how many did you get at a time did you get a six uh, half, usually half a half dozen dozen, dozen. Yeah. she's trying to get real freaky <laughs> Um, ideally, I like to eat plant-based for most of the part. Um, I'm pescatarian, so. You can write with both hands. Huh? <laughs> Wait, what'd you say? I'm pescatarian. Oh, oh, yeah. okay. I can't cook, so I like takeout. I like fried chicken. I like Burger King and chicken nuggets, dinosaur chicken nuggets. Dino I nuggets? feel like you can make me some good ass dinosaur chicken. Air fryer. Okay. Air fryer. Air fryer. Yes. I love the air fryer. That's my baby. Hey guys, so what is your longest relationship you've ever been in? A year. Okay. A year. Three and a half years. And it was like, wow. it was a good one. It was like, a green flag. You could last like yeah, a long term yeah. relationship. I, I don't do like short term. I like long term. Oh. Okay. Buddy? Mine is like two to four years. Cause like, well, well sh after two years, you kind of just uh, I haven't seen her in a long time, but I'm, I'm sure we're, uh, she has uh, someone else on her Instagram now, but I, I still comment here and there. <laughs> so, uh, Have you ever participated in butt stuff in the bedroom? Like a woman doing butt stuff to you? Okay, one time we were in the bathtub. It wasn't that biggest bathtub. And then she like raced her leg a little too far. <laughs> and her toe went, and I'm like, it scared the hell out of me. And <laughs> but it was like. Did you like it? It felt like when she threw the bubble bath in. You know that bath bomb? <laughs> Yeah, it was yeah. the same feeling. Okay. <laughs> Mine was kind of like a hidden surprise because I kind of woke up and I was like, wait, what? Oh and like, oh she just, God. like, I don't know what it is, but girls sometimes always have their, just always want to poke my butt. Like, I like doing I, that. I don't, I don't understand that, but. Do you have a nice butt? Maybe I mean, it's squishy. It's very, it's very, it's very squishy. Yeah. Oh, you gotta wait for that. You gotta wait for that. You gotta wait for that. Well, you don't have to wait for me. Oh, <laughs> oh, yeah. oh yeah. 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 I do got the show. Yeah. Show. It is okay, pretty good for sitting. I have I have never done bus stuff before. Oh. I have not. Are you open honest. to it? My thing is like to be like this might be too much, but honest, just being honest, my ass is like really hairy, <laughs> so I just feel like it's not uh, a possibility. So you have to wax it. Yeah. I know, but just like that's easy to. When, when you wax your ass, how like what the position you got to get into? Like the chicken like thighs up type beat. Ideally, or all that. fours. Not much. Crazy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys. So what is the kinkiest, naughtiest thing you've ever done? I got jerked off on an airplane. Uh, it was just like, I'm terribly afraid of height, uh, flights. So I'm on this plane freaking out. And then like, not freaking out, but like, I'm like, whatever, overthinking it. And she's like, I got you. And I'm like, <laughs> but we, I'm gonna ask for the blanket. They gave me the blanket. Bro. And yeah. it was right there. So was it a two seater? Was there somebody next to me? No, no, uh, we got lucky there was no one next to me. Oh, like it was yeah. a free seat. Yeah. So it was literally yeah. just yeah. me. Over. Yeah, me and her <laughs> and like a blanket and so everyone yeah. around us was asleep and it was like dark. So it was like, yeah. And there was like no like, no one around and so. The plane lady's like, do you guys need any drinks? Do you need <laughs> some lotion? <laughs> okay, everybody else? My mom's gonna kill me for saying this. I'm sorry, mom. 
But so with me and my ex-girlfriend, on the we went, we went to New York City for Christmas. We drove from Buffalo, and on the way back, like she started giving me a head like in the back seat when my mom was driving, and I had like <gasps> and I had like a jacket like over like you couldn't tell like you had you would have like no oh idea God. like I was very like sneaky about it. But the problem was she didn't tell me that she was going to get her car washed like spontaneously at the same time. So like, we're like in the back of like a car wash and like the workers like wash the windows. And I'm just like, oh, like, what's going on that over here? Wow. Yeah. Well, I was at a rave once and this, I was going in the porta potty and this girl was just like, whoop, slid her, her door, uh, the door in. And I was like, oh, well, I guess I just have to pee here. And then, you peed on her? No, no, oh. no, no, she, well, this was before I, I well, we were both in the porta potty, and man, uh, it doesn't have the lid closed. Mm. So oh. uh, I, I'm a, I, at this point, I'm like, I, uh, this is the first time like this has ever happened. Like I'm so just, I'm like ready. I don't know how to explain this. Do you just go? Yeah, you have out, to avoid out, dropping things in this porta potty. So I'm gonna be the girl. I guess you I can be yeah, the yeah, guy. Yeah, yeah. So all we right. had to do so a couple of these. Wait, why am I the guy? All right, now. <laughs> well, all right, yeah, well, all I had right. to do a couple of these. And then you were like, yes. Thrusting. And then, well, well, there's a part where also you don't. You, there's no. They're cover she on it. She sat down. Well, you were supposed oh, to grab. Like, yeah, yeah. Oh, and then oh, like oh, this. Oh, oh, yeah. 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 Oh yeah, you don't want to tip those. All right, first question is, who has daddy problems? My dad's dead. Oh, my bad. Oh. R.I.P. her dad. It's true. I guess that's a problem. Could I ask a question? Yeah. How long is too long for sex? Maybe like over an hour once it starts like getting all frictiony and like you're both tired and you're sore. I feel like you could go rounds. Like I think going rounds is fun. There should be like yeah. a good break like for water. But I feel like a good couple rounds is good. Like so, three hours should be fine. Like with music or like with no music. I think there should be a little bit of light music in the background. Like Frank Ocean type of music. Sure, but nice and low. It doesn't have. To, I can't. Yeah, 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 not yeah, too yeah. loud. Yeah. In the background, like <laughs> down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just a little yeah, yeah. low type. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'd say anything after 15 minutes is. I'm gonna be honest. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 <laughs> and I don't like music really. I think that's kind of cheesy. Oh, Put on like yeah. South Park or something in the background. Mm. Yeah. No okay. trace songs. Or anything. No, yeah. that's just cheesy. <laughs> what was yours? You know, like four hours. Holy shit! I'm just kidding. Probably like two minutes. You guys I'm are good. fucking for real. Yeah. All right, guys, that's the end of that round. All right. Now the girls will decide who they want to keep and who they want to eliminate right in front of the guys. So good luck. Everybody, name who they would keep. I keep Buddy and you and I you and you. You too. <laughs> I for sure keep you, and you, for sure these three. <laughs> I'm a little okay. miffed that you accuse me of cheating. Well, I'm gonna give you guys negative points though, because you're not dressed up in Christmassy theme. I'm a Christmas tree. He's wearing you're green. a Christmas tree. Well, they're both wearing green, yeah. I would say. I think it's already decided. We, all of us didn't mention one person except for you. I'm so sorry. I think it's gonna be you, but you're amazing and you have a great personality and your fit is fire. Yeah, yeah. Thank so you. you're gonna be fine, just fine. All right, well, classify, you've been eliminated, but because you're in the last round, you're gonna help the guys decide who I'm about you to be guys. on her wave. <laughs> you! <laughs> your fit's ugly, your knees are weird. <laughs> All right, you guys have 30 seconds to decide. My but. thing is this, when they were talking about like how long is like too long, they were all like saying like kind of like okay times. She said four hours. I can't. Which way, which way? She said four she hours. She said four hours. I was, that's a lot. No, no, it won't. No, but then she changed it to two minutes, though. I did say two minutes. Well, four hours was a joke. Uh, hey, I'm, I'm a yeah, listener, bro. All right, since so I'm leaving anyway, here we go. He's about to roast. She's the nicest. He's going to roast everybody. She, uh, she answers really fast. She seems like you need, like, a 50-year-old businessman. Like A businessman? Yeah, that, like, has his shit together. Yeah. Like, I feel like here are, like, the boys. You need, like, a man. Like, <laughs> like, like you need somebody that's, like, got their shit. 401k? Come on! <laughs> Yeah. I love your energy. Oh, I wish we could keep you. You're so cool. Kev, who do, you, who do you want to keep and who do you want to eliminate? Eliminate? Fuck. I can go on f pleasing a woman for hours and hours. Two minutes is a little short. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, dude. All right. That's all. But I swear I can go hours and hours. This, this mouth can do wonders. I believe oh. it. I believe it truly. I do believe that too. I believe it truly. I guess we've decided it's her. Wait, what? <laughs> Damn. No, we, I thought we should have heard. Wait. Yeah. Yo, yo, we, them two voted on. I guess it's. He wants to vote her out so she's all to himself, uh, is what she wants. Well, then it's two, one, one, so then that's yeah, the no, one. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. good job. We... 
Good job. Okay, 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 okay. Don't put two brain cells together. <laughs> so the boys have eliminated who? Savannah, Savannah and the girls have eliminated and classify. Thank you guys so much for being a part of it. But before you guys take off, let's see what you guys brought if you guys would have been chosen. Ah, <sighs> you're gonna regret uh, eliminating me? But okay. I got you. A bucket of mother freaking fried chicken. <laughs> oh, you <laughs> called, called it. it. Yeah. You're mad. Yeah. You're mad. Like, I'm gonna munch this though by myself. Right. Let's see what's in there. Oh, oh. oh that just didn't work. All right. I brought, because I was like, a oh, it's board. long, hard, and you can ride it all night long. Oh, oh my god. god. And you will never be bored. Almost Damn. Just got money. Oh, a you right. skateboard. Hey, one use. All right, well, well, all right, thank you guys. We're down to three, so we're gonna keep this round to five minutes, so ask some really interesting questions, and um, good luck. Okay, I got a question. Are you okay with the guy that puts work before you? Yes. I would say yes, because yeah. I do the same, so. Good sense of priorities. Definitely. Awesome. I hate a clean guy, so. Mm -hmm. What would you guys say is your biggest deal breaker in a girl? Honestly, I would say just like people that like completely change like how they act around like certain people. Mm -hmm. Like if we're like together and you act a certain way and then we're within a group, you act a completely different way. That's like a big like turn off for me, 100%. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, for me, it's when a girl doesn't know what she wants. Like, hey, I'm, I'm like, hey, I'm ordering something on Uber Eats. Do you want anything? And she's like, well, I'm looking at like, oh, maybe I want this. I'm like, come on. Well, I'm just going to get this. And, she, and then we order it and then she gets mad. I'm like, I thought you just said whatever. I'm like, well, <laughs> I don't know. I just want... More decisive. Decisive, yes. Okay. Fair. Yeah. If you guys were going out, like where would you go? Would you go to like the bar, the club? Like what's your vibe? How long is the night out? Uh, it could be like a bender. So like after hours or anything like that. Like Honestly, I like house parties more than anything, to be completely honest with you. But if that wasn't an option, I think like a dive bar with like a good, like a good group of friends, like 1,000% because it makes it super fun. Okay. I'm gonna say 100% Nobu. 100% Nobu. Oh, okay. Yes. Oh. 100% Nobu. And yeah. then after Nobu, where are we going? to my place and I'm gonna make you some dessert. Oh. Huh. I like to stay out. <laughs> For how long though? It depends how long. So like 2 a.m. is like the cutoff? Maybe know? like 4 a.m. Okay. Yeah. So do you guys have any examples of dirty talk you would use in bed? I would like to give the first example. This is you. <laughs> mm, you, you slut! Mm, 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 mm. Aggressive, that's good though. Wait, uh, okay. is that okay? Okay, that's okay. Okay, is this a little too hard? <laughs> <laughs> and then, oh, are you okay? Do you need any water? Okay, someone get a water. <laughs> I don't know, so, but slut was your first word of choice. I, I just like know. to be as... <laughs> right into it. He's got a lot of pent up anger, ready to go. Yeah, like you're letting it out on her. No. Traffic. Well, I, I, for, well <laughs> I feel like, hey, I do like a little bit of spanking. I like a little bit of play, I'm like, all right, my, why as well just go ahead first and then scale down, you know? Because then you know what your bar is. Okay. I think it was the dirty talk, not the beating. Oh, well, I can... But that's, it, it goes, they <laughs> go well together. They go yeah, well together. Was... Well, it, it's, it's just better for me to, like, you know, give you the visualization because I like to... I respect it a Honestly, it just, it just, like, changes on, like, whoever I'm with. I don't have, like, the same line with, like, every single girl that like, I sleep with or something. It's more of just, like, honestly, just, like, going with the flow of thinking, like, yeah, baby, there. Sometimes they can't even hear me because I'm just down on them, so it's just more oh. of, like, my tongue. Just, like, you know. It just really depends on the girl in the moment, right. I'd say. Right, Yeah. The one that said he likes to give head, right? Yeah, yeah. 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 Okay. Green flag. So I, I like to do, like, taking charge and um, kind of just saying the what's, like, what's happening. And I'll say, okay, come here, move here. And like, I kind of direct the whole thing. So it's literally like a movie, <laughs> like in bed. <laughs> like you have it mapped out already. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> you say kitchen, counter, bathroom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Love a guy who knows what he wants. All right, what's your dirty talk in bed for you guys? Um, I just, you know, I like to call him daddy. I'm usually a little bit more submissive and I'll just be like, oh, like, where do you want me? Um, you know, like, does that feel good? Like, what can I do better? I'm just very much a pleaser and I like to make my partner feel good. Okay, that's easy to work with too, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's I take direction well, yeah. I would say I'm a big moaner. Moaner and like, kind of like yell. In it's kind of heated in the moment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Moment, yeah. yeah. I don't want to cross talk, but I agree with you. I'm more like, sub I'm dominant in life, so I'm submissive in the bedroom, so, but also like, just going with the flow, saying whatever, moaning, screaming, screams, a lot of screams, mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, that's good, that's good. What are your guys' kinks? 
My kink is I love hearing guys moan. It makes me feel like I'm doing a good job. Yeah, I like spontaneous sex, so like public. Public, somewhere mm -hmm. we're not supposed to have sex, yeah. Oh, we have a lot in common. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I would actually agree with both of you, so I'm gonna run off of that. All right, well, uh, that's the end of that round. Now we're gonna have the guys decide who they want to eliminate first. Good luck. Okay, I guess start off with who we don't want to get rid of. Like, I don't want to get rid of you. Mm -hmm. I love tattoos. I love tattoos. Dude. I have tattoos. You just have to undress me to see them. <laughs> <laughs> All right, hey, she has an arm tattoo too. I have, a, I, have a few, I, have some, I have some around yeah. my body too, like Same. little ones. Yeah. Where is yours? Is Mine's this? on the, the kitty cat and then behind my ear. I don't know if we can show that one. Should we show that one? Maybe oh, we're showing that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, okay. oh yeah. Hey, Pokemon, okay. Yeah. okay. I want to keep the moaner, for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 It's like hot. Okay. Yeah, 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 exactly, yeah. Yeah, she's she's a keep. Now we narrowed it down to two. Wait, you haven't, yeah, you haven't said anything. What are you thinking? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> damn it. I like the moan. Oh. I like the moaning part the most. I'm going with you guys, because I have, I have a door stopper so that you know you can't really he hear the yeah you know what I'm talking about. Well then I would say keep her and her too because the only thing I didn't like about her was that there's nothing wrong with it. But like she's talking about 401k shit like that. I can yeah because we, we both like how she does work like okay that's fine. I'm, so, okay I'm fine okay. With me too. Okay so we then, decided then. Okay. okay. All right guys so the guys Sorry, have decided to eliminate <laughs> Lucy. Sorry, Lucy. Lucy. But it's okay because you can help the girls decide who the guys eliminate. So ladies, you guys have a minute to decide. He gives like Elf on the Shelf. I love the Elf. And I love it. Mm -hmm. And he's a pleaser, like he's a gem. Yeah. Whoever very, dates him both, will be so lucky. I feel like lucky. they're both very sweet. I love you, but the beating scared me. <laughs> <laughs> the little beat, beat, beat. Well, it, it's like, it, it escalates. You know, you... Who are your top two? These yeah. two. These two? Yeah. Oh, that's tough. Who are your top two? These two. My top two are these two, solely because you got really defensive about your future and your 401k. So Fair that's enough. the only thing I'm basing it off of. Fair enough, I agree. Only one guy raised his hand for going down on women. Yeah, I like these I two know. still, so I'm I was, voting I out I was going to go down on yeah, anybody. He, he I'm voting out Elf, but I'll I love Elf. <laughs> I love Elf. He could go to the Christmas party. Yes. <laughs> oh no, Elf, don't hate us. Don't hate us. Ugh. This could be you. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> could be you. <laughs> All right, so the guys have eliminated Lucy. I'm sorry, dude. Um, and then the girls have eliminated Kev. <sighs> this one hurt. All right, so before you guys take off, why don't you, uh, Lucy, why don't you show us what you got? Okay. If the guys chose you. All right, so what I got is actually DIY. It came from the heart. But basically, it's um, a face-mounted camera, oh so you God. wear it on your forehead and you can record back shots with it. Oh, okay. <laughs> your hands are free. Free phone. That's awesome. Wow. <laughs> yeah. mm -hmm. Kev, would you? So you you brought a step stool? It could be anything. It's not. <laughs> I think he brought like. Okay. Is that, it looks like well, there's like maybe Play-Doh in there. I will, it could yeah. be I'll anything. just wrap it from here. You know, I was gonna help you out, mount your stuff. You know, whenever you guys want to move. But also, there's. You know, that's just. Oh, there is a gift. Wait a oh, minute. Oh, there is a Louis bag in here too. Oh. Did you get the ever. money for that? <laughs> My mom stopped sending me money after this one. No, <laughs> buddy. Well, thank you guys so much for coming. I appreciate you guys. Yeah. The door's that way. You can hold hands on our way That's out. A, you know, buddy, you have cheat. a step stool to carry. <laughs> Damn, she didn't want to hold your hand. I was like, Damn. <laughs> All right, so guys, for this round, let's keep it short, but each of you guys get to ask one question. Um, if we called your ex right now, what would they say about you? Mm. Be honest. Honestly, I think she'd say I'm a great person, but she just doesn't like me anymore. Okay. Yeah, in a sense. She might not understand you either. She doesn't really speak English that well. Oh. But, <laughs> <laughs> but like, I'd be fully confident like, having that conversation. I think it'd be kind of cool, honestly. Okay. Yeah. Okay. 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 I would say that she would probably say that I like to have too much, like, talk about too much emotions because, like, sometimes I feel like you can read the room, but if somebody is not like saying something, you want to check in, but some people aren't like open to mm -hmm. saying it. So then she would probably say, I would always constantly check in 
to see if she was okay too much. Okay. I'll add that too, probably my biggest red flag was that like sometimes like if I wanted to like, discuss like a problem like in the moment, sometimes it can be better to wait till the next day to discuss it than like, Gather if, you're, your like thoughts. if you're like drunk like in the moment. Like, yeah. That's the biggest thing she'd probably tell you I have to work on 100%. I think that's a good thing that you wait and gather your thoughts and your words. Are you the type that would like to go through your boyfriend's phone or not? <laughs> I'm gonna say no, just right. because I feel like I mm -hmm. would want to trust my partner, so that mm -hmm. would be kind of like an invasion of privacy and of trust, so. I'm gonna agree with that, but I think if I ever wanted to go through your phone, if, let's say just, yeah. you should be okay with it, like I should know your password. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But if you're like, as soon as I see any little skittish movement, like I grab your phone, you like jump and you grab it out of my hand or something. Or like the phone being flipped yeah. over yeah, all the time Yeah, I'm gonna be you. very yeah, like yeah. concerned suspicious. and thinking that's yeah. suspicious. Yeah, yeah your Absolutely. phone should be something that's easy. Yeah, but I think invasion of privacy Yeah. Mm -hmm. as well. Yeah. But um, overall, yeah, I think if I wanted to even just go through it, just because mm -hmm. I should be able to. There shouldn't be anything in oh, there. Oh, that's good. Yeah. Should be comfortable with it. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. What's your opinion on like a guy having a bunch of like girlfriends? I eat a plant-based diet. Are you open to not eating meat anymore? All right, so I'm gonna give the ladies the option to decide whether to eliminate first or eliminate second. So if you guys eliminate someone first, then there'll be one guy to decide between you two. Or, but if you decide to eliminate second, then the guys will eliminate one of you, and then the last girl will decide between the last two guys. So what do you guys want to do first? I would say you should just go first, though. So. Oh, that's my thing. What do you think? What do you think? Okay, Are you that's okay. fine, that's fine. I'm just scared of what they're gonna roast us. All right, guys, good luck. My choice, honestly, I would pick to say the green because I feel like I match with her a bunch of more things than I think I would with the other person. Now, but you <laughs> Oh yeah. my God, this is oh, hard. Oh, it's a tough one, Yeah, it's huh? tough. They're beautiful. They both work. Like... They both work, they have jobs. Yeah. <laughs> I would say the opposite, bro, though, because she does work. I don't know, she talked about 401k, like Roth IRA. Do you have a savings? Mm, yeah, it's there. <laughs> There's a little hesitant. Yeah, yeah, a little hesitant. It's there. <laughs> I use it. <laughs> okay, all right. Yeah, we've decided. Yes. Yeah. And I kind of do want to see what you have. All right, Sammy, you can reveal what you brought the boys. Okay. Oh, it looks like sneakers or Amazon. Okay. I wish it was, but. It's a heated blanket. Oh, oh yo. that's so thoughtful. It's the best gift, honestly. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Essie, so now it's your turn to eliminate one of the guys. This is really tough, but I'm gonna say based off of, you pretty much said you didn't think you would get along with me, unfortunately, so I'm gonna go with you. It's, uh, it makes sense. Yeah, like you literally told me you didn't like me, so <laughs> actually. All right, so my gifts. Oh man, I taped it so much. <laughs> I was saying before, like this would help us have some fun in the bedroom, uh -huh. or if you want, to, <laughs> if your boss is not giving you the raise that you want, it's uh -huh. gonna help with it. Little cousin Timmy wants to have some fun outside. It's oh. perfect tool for it. It's multi-useful tool. It's not for beating. I taped it way too much, but pretty much it's not a baseball bat. Though. Okay. It's a slow pitch softball bat, so oh. it's, a little, it's a little bit different. <laughs> it's a softball bat. Yeah. So Thank you. You as well. Joshua, Essie, you guys have chosen each other, but why don't you guys reveal what you guys got? So why don't you open it? Why don't you, Okay. why don't you get in there? Right there, actually, just. Wait a minute. Wait, the important part also is in there. Oh, it's, it's, it's hidden. Yeah, if you open that up, we got a little it's a perfect date night. Wow, I got a coupon for a uh, free head. And wings, it's a perfect date night. Wow. Yeah. Is, this, is this actually valid though? Head and wings, well, maybe. Well. You're gonna be a little upset at mine because, uh, I don't know, it depends on how you wanna take it. Okay. I'll just let you do the honors. All right, I'm nervous now. Wait, 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 actually before you open it, remember oh. my line. It was, uh, it's sticky and grippy and can be used to make a thong, but with one wrong move, it's gonna have you sing a Michael Jackson song. No, absolutely no idea. The end part really just throws everything off. Tate, get it? <laughs> it's sticky and grippy and I can use it to, What's the Michael Jackson part? Like ripping it off you. Whoop! Oh. Yeah! That's it. That was it. There we go. So nice to meet you. Yeah. Yeah. Woo! Let's put, let's put it up. Let's put it up. Here. What? The, we uh, won! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Because I was hanging out with my brother and my 